high building cost, high real estate market, working from home, people moving out into the country. These are all reasons that self-building is becoming very, very popular right now. But is it worth it financially? What is that investment going to be for you? I'm gonna break down our build so far for you. From the very beginnings of where we got started to getting totally dried in, what it's cost us, and then I'm gonna show you the projection of where we think we're headed in our next stage. So hit that thumbs up, make sure to subscribe, and we'll get started here. For a large storage trailer and our camper, we paid $11,000. Our land, we got eight and a half beautiful acres for 7,000 per acre. Doing some excavating, getting water, electricity, and septic on property cost about 24,000. Rough and plumbing, $2,000. Concrete slab ended up being around $22,000. That's with us doing footers, forms, reinforced rebar, and paying for the concrete. And we did get some finishers to help us out with the actual pour. Framing up our bottom floor up to the roof sheathing cost $44,500. Our metal roof, we paid under $12,000 and installed it ourselves. Windows, $7,500. That's pretty detailed, but let's look a little bit bigger picture. To date, we've spent about 143 grand, but that's beginnings of our land payments, that's land development, and construction costs for the house. Just on the house, we're sitting right at about 100 grand so far. That's foundation to dry it in. Now, I'm gonna tell you that number's a little bit higher as far as the framing. Yes, part of that was due to lumber shortage and rising prices, but we also planned ahead to be able to finish out our top floor, which we will probably do a video on later. So let's really just talk construction on the house. To finish the house, we estimate will probably cost between 80 and 100 grand. We know there could be fluctuation in prices. We've seen that so much in the last year. So in the end, we're really estimating the house construction cost to be right at around $200,000. Now, if you want to get an idea for how much labor is going to add to this, a good thing to go by is just that estimate of 20 to 40 percent that labor is going to add to your construction costs. And of course, my caveat to all this is we are not done yet. So please check back, see how we end up finishing it up, and I'll do an update when we're all done. Now, I don't want to leave you without saying this important thing. When I say the word investment, don't just think money. Think about what you're investing in other than financially. Is building your own house a great financial investment? Absolutely. But you have to think about where you're spending your time and your effort. Even if we never sell it, this house is still an investment in our lives and in our kids' lives. So I hope this breakdown is helpful for you. Always remember to research your area, research cost in your area, land, and consider those things.